Before today, more than 70,000 people were told to keep out of city libraries because of their overdue fines. Now the city's making life a little bit easier for people by practicing some radical forgiveness. They're eliminating those fines, basically telling people in conclusion, don't worry about it. We don't want to penalize people. Um, we want them to bring the materials back, but we're saying it's okay, we understand if you're a little bit late. And so we're going to get rid of those fines. Last year, the city stopped charging late fees at libraries. We changed the policy, so now moving forward, we don't charge overdue fines. We want you to bring the item back. If you don't bring it back, you have to pay for it, but we don't charge you that late fee every day. San Diego City Councilman Chris Kate pushed the idea, saying the city was wasting more money trying to collect fines. We found that we brought in about $600,000 in fines a year, and it cost us $1.2 million to collect those fines. The city says clearing fines and allowing people to use libraries will help communities that need it the most. We found that in our more underserved communities like our Valencia Park Malcolm X Library, the Logan Heights Library in Barrio Logan had um, over 40 percent of their patrons were barred from access to the library because they had fines they couldn't pay. And there, those are the communities that really need us the most. The city forgave thousands of fines dating back to at least 2005. Library staff plan to email people letting them know they are no longer banned. Matt Hoffman, KPBS News.